I, uh, God bless you, Daryl. <laughs> Mayor, mayors, thank you so much. Charlie, thank you. Mike, this guy is one courageous amigo. <laughs> thank you, Peter. Thank you all. I gotta, I gotta thank my family first. Uh, my beautiful wife, Carol. Come here, Carol. The First Lady of Florida, my First Lady and the love of my life, Carol Christ. She seems to love her. I'm on the bed here. I, I call him the real Charlie Christ. I'm Junior. <laughs> Dr. Christ, my beautiful mother, Nancy. Thank you so much. Where's Margaret? Margaret Ann? Come here. The new campaign manager, Margaret Christ. service is supposed to be about. That's what people are thirsty and hungry for right now. 
You know, we see these people in Washington and they go back and forth and they argue all day long. You just start to wonder. I certainly started to wonder, who's speaking for me? Who's worried about the people before the party? What happened to that idea? You know, that's what it's supposed to be about. You. And you. Well, this is going to be a great journey. It really is, but we have got to work hard. I know you know that. But listen, I don't have a party anymore. And these parties are powerful. Don't make any mistake about it. This is exciting. This is energetic. This is unbelievable. This is uncharted territory. So we have to really be well organized. Please sign up. Please get on Facebook. Please go to the website. And direct all your friends, Steve, to do so. That's critically important to do. We've got to build an email list. You know, a few campaigns ago, those things didn't matter. But they make all the difference in the world now. You know, we got to keep fundraising. And as Dane said, where are you, Dane? God bless Dane Eagle. Dane Eagle. Come here. Please. Dane, Dane is a great man. I'm going to tell you a true story about Dane and his family. Um, he's from the Fort Myers area. And when I ran... All right, Southwest Florida is in the house. But when I ran for governor, uh, I remember we were down, it was about a week before the end of the campaign, and his father showed up, and he was holding one of our signs, and there were some reporters there with us, one named Gary, and uh, Dane's father was very generous to me, and so he went up to Dane's dad, and he said, how come you gave that much money, your money, to Charlie? And he said, it wasn't my money. And the reporter thought he had a real story about, you know, something else wrong going on. And he said, well, what do you mean, it wasn't your money? He said, it was God's money. He said, I invested in because I wanted to do the right thing. And Dane is, you know, it doesn't fall far from the tree, same kind of guy. All right. Welcome to All right. So thank you for being here. And thank you for your support. And thank you for your prayers. And thank you for contributing. And thank you for spreading the word. Now somewhere in here, Michelle told me there's a bumper sticker. Actually, it's right here. Please take one of these. Please put it on your car or your truck. It, you know, they tell me that, that each, I mean, each one of these on a car will get you seven more votes. On a truck, it's 12. <laughs> I have no idea if that's accurate. That sounds good. So please do it, and they'll come off. You, you'll see on the back of the famous removable sticker, so they won't, they won't hurt your car, but they'll spread the word. And, you know, in politics we talk about television and radio advertising and, you know, all these things. But in any election, in every election, in the last few days, when it's just about time for people to really make their choice and make their decision, people talk to each other. If you have one of these on your car and you go to fill up your gas, hopefully it doesn't go to your mind. But you go to fill up it up with gas, other people at the other pump will say, why do you have that sticker on your car? Why are you supporting him? And then the most important thing in democracy will happen. Two people will look each other in the eye and talk about why they've made the decision they have. Why they're supporting the candidate that you are. And that will make all the difference in the world. And then democracy will happen. And then we'll win. Because of you. So God bless you. Thank you. Thank you very much.